All right, guys, we are in celebration mode. Off Sholem is making us some delicious burgers. We are celebrating the placing of the menorah that the boys made last year. And this week they have been working on restoring and painting it. Wow, guys, you did an awesome job on your menorah. So awesome. Who helped paint? Who helped paint? Wow. Wow, so they all had a part. You guys enjoying your burgers? Yes. What do you like on your burger? Let me see that. Ooh, that looks delicious. Wow. You ready for Hanukkah? Yes. Wow. All right, guys, this is how we do it, Cohen style. All right, guys, the festivities, the celebration has come to an end. And I have to say, I'm feeling extremely emotional. So forgive me if I burst out in tears. As I came in and I began to reflect, I started to think just having the day in mind in preparation for Hanukkah, setting up the menorah, thinking about the festival of lights and everything that it represents and means. And I'm sitting at the table, eating burgers with the kids. And here comes Safta, the boy Safta shows up, of course, bearing gifts. And I think to myself, we don't always realize the importance of having a support system as a family. And I've often said in many, many of my videos, the importance of having your kids in programs and really focusing on, on community at large. And I'm not talking about religious community. I'm just talking about the community at large, your support system for your family. In today's world, it really, really takes a lot to raise a child. There is so many different aspects. We have the electronics, many people have televisions in their homes, and there's so many things that you have to be careful for and monitor. Anyways, that's a whole other subject, but they say it takes a village. And I can say with all my heart, I'm so thankful that I truly have a village behind me. And I'm so very, very, very grateful. And as we prepare for Hanukkah, as we get ready for this festival of lights, I want to encourage each and every one of you to don't forget that the blessings are right in front of you. They're with our neighbors, they're with our friends, they're with your family, they're with even the people who are angry and upset, they're even with those. Even in them, there is a blessing. We just have to see it. And as we usher our way into the Festival of Lights, don't forget to be thankful for everything you have in your life now. So I just wanted to share that with you guys. And I have to show you this amazing, amazing gift that Safta brought all the way from Eretz Israel. Let me see if I can get it. Take a look at this handcrafted menorah. It is so, so, so beautiful. Aside from all the tzitzit, aside from everything else that she brought the kiddos, take a look at this. It is so beautiful, guys. You know what it's like to have to get all those candles in there. This thing is so super amazing. It has the glass cups, the wigs ready. All it's waiting for is the oil and to be kindled. It's going to be absolutely amazing. I'm really, really so, so very thankful. So if you're jealous, you should be. <laughs> just kidding, guys. Just kidding. Don't thumbs down me. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> As you prepare for the Festival of Lights, wishing you and yours many, many, many blessings. Bye.